Data from UNICEF shows that 418,614 girls enrolled in schools in Sokoto State, which represents 44 percent, while 545,711 got registered in Zamfara State, which represents 62 percent of the number. But the UNICEF Sokoto Chief of Field Office, Mariam Darwesh, emphasized the need for the government in both Sokoto and Zamfara states to allocate resources to ensure the sustainability of girls' education project, GEP3. And this advocacy is not necessarily just to be brought forward by development partner, but we, of course we advocate with the government, state government, to support girl education programs. Um, we also, as I said, development partners, communities, families, um, all of them to come together to make sure that they support girl education. In her presentation tagged why educating girls is important, the general manager, Education UNICEF, Sokoto Field Office, Miriam Maresu, highlighted the benefits of educating the girl child. Education is an important building block and the most impactful way to empower girls. It influences critical human development outcomes. It reduces inequality. Educated girls are far more likely to be aware of issues surrounding violence and abuse and are less likely to become victims of domestic and sexual abuse or human trafficking. While the Commissioner for Basic and Secondary Education, Sokoto State, Bello Abubakar, notes that the state has achieved a lot under the UNICEF program. Quality and system strategy, which include increasing improvements in enrollment, especially girls, awareness creation on the importance of education, promoting learning environment, promoting planning and decision making processes which support evidence based skill of women. The Girls' Education Project, GEP3, is funded by the Foreign, Commonwealth and Development Office, FCDO, of the United Kingdom and implemented by the UNICEF in collaboration with the governments of the six GEP3 states.